My, my, my talk with you tonight is about two things. One, do a good, deep inspection of yourself. Are you, perpetra are you a criminal? Are you doing abuse? And number two, equally important, are you the one being abused? Because if you're the one being abused, a lot depends on you. And if you're the one being abused, you're gonna, bro you're gonna break. And when you break, you're not gonna be able to do what you're supposed to do. You're not gonna be able to maintain. Don't worry about making people happy. You can't. رِضَ النَّاسِ غَيَةٌ لَا تُدْرَكْ Making people happy is a canyon, there's no bottom to it. You have to be able to make Allah happy. You have to be able to tell yourself in all consciousness that you did not, you can stand in front of Allah if you die right now. You can stand in front of Allah and say, Ya Allah, I did not take her rights, his rights, their rights. I didn't do wrong by them. I did right by them. I know they don't feel that way, but you know and I know what I did. That's Ihsan. Ihsan is about your own conscience. Because if you go by people's standards, you are worthless no matter what you do. <laughs> no matter what you do. Our parents, for example, from different cultures, they have this thing, no matter how well you do, you could be the head of you know, cardiac surgery at a hospital, you're the most successful of their children, and they look at you and say, you know, I expected so much more. Everybody else looks up to you, but your parents are like, you're, why are you such a loser? Why are you such a disappointment? You're just not good enough. That's okay. You're not good enough for them, maybe. And maybe you're not good enough for your wife. She talks down to you all the time. She makes you feel like garbage all the time. Maybe your children make you feel bad. Maybe that's the case. I don't know. But no one thing. You have to do right by Allah. That's it.